I'm going to try out an app on a clip of surveillance video released by the police in a homicide investigation. And this is the emotion recognition beta demo on Face++. And the reason why I'm doing it is because the homicide detective in this case looked at this video and concluded that all was well in this house based on this clip, that there were no issues between the husband and wife in these scenes. Okay, so the husband has taken the dog out to the back patio and he comes back inside and he walks into the guest bathroom and he closes the door and he doesn't turn on the light. And about a minute later, the wife comes down the hallway and I think subjectively she looks irritated. Like maybe she was in the middle of something and was interrupted and has to go see what's up with the dog. The The morning after this scene, this woman is dead in a hospital, but brain dead from blunt force head trauma. So I'm curious to see if face plus plus detects any emotions, you know, in this video, I'm going to upload this screenshot of her. And according to face plus plus, she is angry. The algorithm detects facial cues that it associates with anger. Yeah, I agree with that. So, but what's going on with the husband? I think that he also looks irritated and impatient and it's like he's turning away from her as as if he wants to get away. He wants to go down the hallway and I think that he's scowling at her. I think that he's, I think he's mad at her. So let's upload a screenshot to Face++. Okay, it says that that's a neutral look. He's not, there's not a lot going on there. And let's take another frame. This time, Face++ says that he's disgusted. That's a pretty strong characterization. So let's take another frame. Even more clearly, his face displays cues that the algorithm associates with disgust. Now, I'm not saying that this proves anything. I doubt that this technology would be used in a courtroom ever, but it, uh, I think still it can be a valuable investigative tool. I mean, if a detective is basing his investigative strategy on his own subjective interpretations of the emotional content of digital images, this tool could serve as a helpful second opinion. If, as in this case, you know, the detective says, oh, this is a happy couple, there's no issues here, so obviously this couldn't have been a homicide, Um, you know, why not just upload a couple screenshots to Face++ and see if, if you get a different idea.